Yo, what is going on? Today is my trade recap, okay? Um, today I got my funded um, trading account um, with my prop firm. So what that means is essentially whatever profit that I make on this account, um, I get to cash out, okay? Um, so I had a trade today, I just wanna show you guys real quick. Um, so we had a liquidity sweep uh, around 8.55 is when we took out these relative highs over here. Okay, we took out some highs over here. Um, and then about this point um, is when I went down to the one minute, okay? Now remember with my strategy, right? Stuff can happen before 10 a.m. My, my trading window is 10 to 11, right? but I'm looking for an entry between 10 and 11, but stuff can happen before. So for instance, we had a liquidity sweep at 8.55. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's go down to the one minute. On the one minute time frame. Um, <clears throat> a little aggressive. On the one minute time frame, there was this fair value gap right here that came in broke structure and then I went uh, I went for a sell, went short, okay? On my trading account today, my funded trading account. Um, and I ended up going short at 10.30 and made a little bit of profit, okay? Um, this first arrow represents that I took off 0.75%, or not 0.75%, sorry, 75% of my lot size um, at this point here uh, because my uh, risk to reward ratio was 0.75 and what that does is if price goes all the way back up and hits my stop loss um, it it prevents me from losing any money at all i would still gain money um, after closing out 75 percent of my position right here price kept coming down to about this point here and i took off um 0.50 of my lot size. And then over here, I ended up closing out uh, before this big retracement. <clears throat> um, I had two big mistakes today. Um, and not in the fact that I lost money, but there was a fuck ton of money out on the table that I could have grabbed. Um, so when this morning kicked off, I marked out my stop loss above the fair value gap um, and then a little bit above these relative highs right here, okay? Um, that was fine, but my big problem was is I originally had my price set over to these two relative lows, um, and I'll show you on the five minute, well, I'll just do it now. On the five minute, there was this real long candle, and I had set, set it as a liquidity point um, and that's where I originally had set my uh, take profit. But the one mistake I made is I ended up getting impatient and doubting myself because on the five minute, uh, let's reset this. On the five minute, there was this fair value gap here, right here. Okay, and I ended up closing right here um, in this fair value gap range uh, because I was a little bit nervous that price was just gonna reverse out of it, right? Uh, but if I would have waited, I would have seen that literally 10 minutes later, ended up closing through this fair value gap, kind of negating it, and then ended up coming all the way down to this liquidity level down here. Um, so my one out of two mistakes today uh, is leaving money on the table is that I had trade, I, I closed my entire position too early. Um, I should have waited, extended it out, left my level just where it is, move this down here. Cool. I would have fucking bang. Second dumb mistake that I had made. So this is when the liquidity sweep, let me, let me delete some of this shit real quick. With this, we'll delete the arrows. Okay, um, and we'll leave everything else. 
Second mistake I had made is let's mark out 10 o'clock. So this is when I start trading is 10 to 11, okay? On the five minute time frame, we had a break on this first one. Let's go down to the one minute, okay? I traded off of this fair value gap right here. Price came up and reversed out, right? But I fucking missed it, but it's okay. Is because as I was looking, right, I was waiting for fair value gaps to come down, right? Here's a fair value gap right here, but we closed all the way through it. So I negated it. I don't really like that. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, this fairy value gap is the one that I ended up taking. But if I would have just looked a little bit more left, right? Let's see. This fairy value gap's negated. No fair value gap here. Very small fair value gap that got closed out. Okay. What is this? Wow. Here's a fair value gap that I didn't see this morning. Okay. If I would have seen this fair value gap this morning, right? Price came into that range, but it never closed out. And it was on uh, the same side that I'm looking to sell. And we had a break of structure right here. I could have easily moved this to about there. I would probably, so this would be my uh, most recent high for like a liquidity level. I wouldn't go right on that. I would go a little bit higher because broker spreads, okay? Then would have had the same uh, level down to this liquidity area down here. And I would have had a fucking fat, Return. Actually, it was this liquidity level. Sorry. This one. Would have been a juicer of a fucking trade today. But I made those two mistakes. Um, and I still made money. Okay. I still made money. Um, but I left a lot of money out on the table uh, because of those two mistakes. One mistake being I was impatient. My other mistake I didn't see this other fair value gap over here when we had a retracement and then it fucking broke structure down, right? So two things to learn from today. Make sure that after a liquidity sweep, everything is covered. There's no standing fair value gaps. There's no standing liquidity areas. Um, look for retracements and then just be patient. <clears throat> um, only, and I took off 0.75 and 0.50 lot size. Um, or a percent or whatever. Um, only do it once, right? Just do it once because I would have netted a lot more even though I left a lot on the table um, if I just only took one profit. So only do the 0.75, which would have been like right here, okay? 0.75, cover it, keep the rest, and just let it fucking run, dude. All right. That is all for my July 8th recap. I hope you guys have a wonderful fucking day. And oh, and just in case you guys uh, don't believe me, because I know I in my last video we were talking about the the uh, how I passed my thing and whatever. Um, this is it right here. Oh, just letting you guys know. This is the certificate that they gave me saying that I was officially funded. Um, so like I said, whatever I make on this account, I can keep. So yeah, hope you guys have a good day. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.